pear-shaped puffball. You slice them in half like this. The inside should be marshmallow white. And that's how you can tell this edible mushroom from poisonous lookalikes. The poisonous lookalikes will all be dark on the inside. Here we are, mid to late October, Missouri Ozarks, got a nice mess of edible mushrooms right here. I'm going to harvest these and serve them up. I've already, I've already tried one. If you're, if you're not quite sure <clears throat> about the um, edibility of a mushroom, you don't want to start with a large batch. What I did when you first eat it, what I did was I took this mushroom right here, sliced it in half, make sure the inside is marshmallow white. And then I ate half the mushroom. And according to the uh, what I read about the poisonous lookalikes, if uh, they're going to affect you, it should affect you within about 24 hours. So you don't want to, if you're not sure about a mushroom, you don't want to start with a large dose. You want to start with a small dose. So I'll eat um, half of this mushroom. I'll wait 24 hours. And if no ill effects, then I will know that we're good here. But I'm, uh, I'm confident about this mushroom anyway because of that right there. And that is because when you slice it, when you slice it in half, the inside should be white like a mushroom. And the poisonous lookalikes will be dark inside. Some good eating there. Note the darker brown spot on the top runs kind of... Um, elongated slightly but that's not always the case some of them just appear to be more like a spot but if you do see the elongated ones that's a good clue Nice mess of edible mushrooms. That's some good eating there. Pear-shaped puffballs. I'm going to use a soft brush. This is a mushroom brush. Very soft. You don't want to wash mushrooms. You want to brush the dirt off of them. Now when I get ready to cook these, I'll go ahead and just trim off that little dirty root part right there. But I want to get majority of the dirt off of them before I put them aside. It's good organic soil anyway. Right out of the woods. 
soil is absolutely packed full of beneficial bacteria so you shouldn't worry about getting a little dirt in your mushrooms anyway and besides when we cook them that dirt will be sterilized anyway of course some of these I might eat raw that's okay too we've been eating these mushrooms fresh and they are delicious and my wife uh, saved some of the fresh ones for a recipe that she's making and the remainder I'm going to dehydrate for later use. I sliced these mushrooms into thirds because they will dry faster when they're sliced like this. I kept a few intact here just because I wanted to see how they do when they um, when I dry them whole. You can also dry them whole, it just takes longer. So we'll uh, dehydrate these and have mushrooms for later use. Okay, it's been over 24 hours uh, with the lead on with the heat on very low, and they seem to have dried nicely. So what I'll do is um, put these in a plastic bag, and when I get ready to use these, all I have to do to rehydrate them is just um, add water. Here are the whole mushrooms. They dried nicely too. Yeah, they're ready to go too. This is Survival Doc, reminding you, be prepared, or be prepared to be fleeced.